Hello guys, this is Kevin with BSPO and um, Survival Squatch. Today's video is going to be on flint and steel. Again, um, I'm new to the skill of flint, of flint and steel. Um, but this is just my take on it and what I've learned. So um, don't take it to heart if it's not the way you do it. Um, parental advisory if, if needed. You know, um, you're out in the woods, I always practice safety along with it. But again, um, all flint steel kits should come with a good striker, if I can get it out. A nice piece of flint with sharp edges on it, because that's what you need to strike it on. And of course, some good char cloth. Char cloth makes a big difference. And um, not to mention, um, don't slack off on your bird's nest um, if you do if you che um, cheap away with it then um, it's just gonna be harder work for you but uh you guys enjoy the video hey guys this is Kevin from uh, bushcraft survival purpose outdoors and survival squatch today I want to show you the skill of flint and steel fire starting um, this nice little kit I got from Francis Kirk pretty little kit come with a nice little pouch to put it in um, usually your flint and steel kits come with um, a nice carbon steel striker char cloth and chert flint or even um, quartz rock and what you want is you want your flint or whatever other stone you have to have a sharp edge and to cut into the metal because that's what it shreds off and makes spars. As you can see, I got a couple there. All right, put my glasses on. hold my stone about a 45 degree that way it gets a good hit on the edge and start striking baby that ember for a minute Then you want to put it in your bird's nest or to some of your fire starts. And if you're going to build a bird's nest, do not try to skip out on it and um, cheap will cheap out on it. Try to work it up as best you can. Set yourself on fire. And there she goes. And that's flint and steel, guys. It's that easy. Just get out and practice like I have. And um, thank you, Squint and Quentin, for uh, helping me out when I was learning. You guys go over and check him out on his uh, page. Quentin, Quentin is what it's called. He himself has a lot of stuff you can learn on there. Let's go bring this over to the fire and see what we can do. Oops. I let it go out. All we gotta do is just blow on it.
And there we go. Got her back, brought her back to life. Now I'm gonna use this fur to cook us some weenies or something on. This is Kevin. Thank you for watching.